The New England crime family is now leaderless. The man at the top of this chart, Anthony D'Annunzio, is the acting boss of the New England La Cosa Nostra. This morning he appeared before a judge charged with racketeering and extortion. Target 12 investigator Tim White broke the story first on WPRI.com. That's right, and he joins us live outside federal court in Providence. The indictment against Anthony D'Annunzio accuses him of being the new acting mob boss of the New England crime family, running things from Boston. And prosecutors say he tried to expand his criminal operation by reaching out to a New York crime family. Anthony D'Annunzio of East Boston, seen here in undercover video, was arrested early Wednesday morning and shipped to Providence. He faces seven counts, from racketeering to extortion, and a sweeping federal crackdown into organized crime. D'Annunzio was arrested without incident at the Gemini Social Club in the north end of Boston. Prosecutors say the New England mob is now leaderless. The indictment reveals D'Annunzio allegedly met with a high-ranking member of a New York crime family on several occasions. We allege that he collaborated with senior members of the Gambino fam crime family to expand his corrupt business practices and to discuss the rules of the New England LCN. In one of those conversations, prosecutors say D'Annunzio was caught on tape bragging about what he'd do to a soldier who didn't follow orders. Quote, I'll bury you right in the expletive ground. I'll stay there expletive 10 hours until you're dead. D'Annunzio is accused of taking protection payments from several Rhode Island strip clubs. It's the latest development in a case that has already led to plea deals with seven defendants, including the former mob boss Luigi Baby Shacks Minocchio. D'Annunzio's name now topping the chart of defendants snared in this sting. Organized crime likes to believe that their reach is long. Our reach is longer. Prosecutors say D'Annunzio took the reins as the New England mob boss in late 2009, early 2010. D'Annunzio pleaded not guilty. He will be held at the Wyatt Detention Center in Central Falls until a bail hearing next month. Live with the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, Eyewitness News.